people welcome back to the canada info hub channel it's me your girl wolo it's been a while i sat down to you know talk about any topic on immigrating and life in canada and everything and if this is the first time you're seeing my video i would say thank you welcome to this channel just quickly do one thing subscribe and click on the notification bell and also give me the thumbs up I usually say smash the like button but i won't say that <laughs> just give it a thumbs up you know i need the thumbs up okay so have you watched yesterday's video if not watched it the video is loaded with information concerning immigration it was actually the minister of um, immigration that was speaking in yesterday's video so quickly go and watch yesterday's video and you'll get loaded information from that video but today i am not talking about immigration i'm talking about careers one of the most important thing you also need to know about life in canada is the career you choose when you eventually land in canada it's very important to know what you want to do for some people they've already made up their mind on what they want to do when they eventually land while some people they land and then try to figure out what they want to do in terms of um, career because sometimes it is not what you used to do back home that you come to Canada to do sometimes you just have to switch like for me now you know I've switched to become a regulated Canadian immigration consultant see anyway so back to what I was trying to say um some people have to switch careers and there are some careers that are very very lucrative in Canada like those guys they are always hot cake um, they, they hardly look for jobs because jobs always look for them because of what they do and there are some careers you find yourself um struggling and um, trying to get your feet in the door you have to be in competition with so many people uh before you get an opportunity so today i'm talking about switching careers and i'll be talking about switching to the tech careers of course we all know that the world has changed drastically due to covid and almost everything is being run by technology now and if you're not in the tech space, it's like you're losing a lot of things. You're lagging behind because we are in a technologically fast paced world. Every day there's a new uh, app coming up. Every day there's a new social media account coming up. Every day something new is happening, you know. So you just have to ask yourself, which of the careers would you switch to? Do you want to switch into healthcare or do you want to switch into technology? And for some people, they would say, oh, I don't like technology. It's not... You know technology is always it has too much mathematics and all that but there are several aspects of technology that you can switch to that does not require programming or coding several of them and i want to introduce to you an organization called heels and tech it's basically run by a woman and she's into information technology and she's into training people to transition into technology from different aspects or different occupational backgrounds let's say you used to be an administrative person and you want to switch to a tech background you can actually do some courses or do something in business analysis and then you switch to business analysis you know so tech these days is very very important um especially in canada if you don't have anything related to information technology is like you're lagging behind so um this video is actually sponsored by Hills and Tech and they are starting a training on the 23rd of January this month. Of course, you know, part of your plans should be investing in yourself. Yes, and you have to invest in yourself, especially if you're already in the process of immigrating to Canada. And this is an opportunity to invest in yourself, especially if you're looking to switch careers to technology. So they are going to do trainings in Salesforce CRM. Salesforce, if you don't know Salesforce, well, you will get to learn more about Salesforce when you um, register to take the training. So they'll take courses in business analysis and product management, personal branding. So in switching careers, you don't need to know about programming and, you know, uh, networking and other aspects, other technical aspects of the information technology industry. There are several soft skills aspects of the information technology that you can actually switch to that can help boost your career and can help you get better job, like six figure jobs. Um, I, I, I think I read a story of a YouTuber who studied, um, I think was it psychology? She, she did psychology somehow in her first degree. And at some point she wasn't getting any traction. She, she, she couldn't even get a job. She did, she did psychology in the U S she couldn't get a job. And then she decided to switch to tech and she got a six figure paying job earning about 200 and something 
almost 220,000 US dollars. You know, so that's the importance of switching careers to so something that will always be in demand that will make you, you know, scale up and not have issues when it comes to looking for job opportunities because they are always looking for people in this industry. And of course, you know, we women, it's very hard for us to follow up with technology. <laughs> Even me, I am struggling with technology. So I want to introduce to you Hilt and Tech and they are the sponsors of this video. Hilt and Tech is an organization that is to training people who intend to switch their careers to technology. So you'll be learning a lot from them. They can train you on so many other um, tech related occupations and how you can get job opportunities, how you can switch your career from whatever you used to do before into the, these other aspects of the technology occupation that does not need programming um, or maybe network engineering or whatever or software developer or whatever. So and I want, I want to encourage you to put it as part of your plans to invest in yourself this year. You know, there's something about investing in yourself. If you invest in yourself, there's always returns after investment. And this is a good, this is a very good opportunity to invest in yourself. So I'll be leaving the details of Hilt and Tech in the description box of this video. I'll be leaving the details of the link to their Instagram page. Um, also contact her. So if you need more information on how you can switch or transition your career to technology if you're able to invest yourself um, by taking part in this training you will definitely see the returns on investment i believe in returns on investment i don't believe you just train money to go and learn something i believe in you know putting money where i know that i will get maximum returns on investment and hilt and tech will show you how to get maximum returns on your investment when you train with them on how to transition from whatever you're doing into a tech career and there are these tech careers they pay well you know they pay as much as eighty thousand dollars hundred thousand dollars i just talked about a story of a lady who transitioned and she's earning two hundred twenty thousand us dollars so please check the description box of this video um i'll also be displaying the information on this video you will see uh, the flyer check the description box as well for more details and invest in yourself this year should be about investing in yourself and investing in your career if you've been doing something for 10 years and you're stuck in that thing and you're not moving forward you're not progressing you're not seeing any promotion then it is time to transition to something that will give you um the six figure earnings that you're looking for and this is one opportunity i don't want you to miss out on the training will be starting on the 23rd of january 2021 please take advantage of this opportunity and don't miss out on this opportunity to invest in yourself 2021 is a year of investing in yourself and getting maximum returns on your investment. So this is information I want to share today. Thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video. Bye-bye.